most precious resource California has. Um, I've made talks many times that, that basically, you know, Southern, all of California, but Southern California even is an ocean-based economy. Um, that's why land in Barstow is much cheaper than it is in San Bernardino, and that's why it's much cheaper than, than here, um, because everything is based on your proximity to the ocean. That is an idea of how important the ocean is to California. And really one of the, the very special aspects of it is of the 1,100 mile coastline, almost all of it is open to public access. You know, we, long time ago, and then because of the great work of the Coastal Commission, you know, has, has made allowed development and, and it's surprising, as difficult it is sometimes to get things through the Coastal Commission, most of the time things do get through. But one of the things the Commission does is, is guarantee public access and public access is so important and, and uh, the little bit of the way it works is is when a project is approved through the Coastal Commission accesses are delineated but they're they're and required but there's 25 years for the Coastal Commission or for some entity a city uh, an organization like ours or some entity to pick up that easement and to then make it real. If it's not picked up in 25 years, then it disappears and it is part of private property and the public loses. And so we, for one, have, have always supported public access and managing it. And, and this is one of those cases. A few years ago, um, we were getting into 25 years and the Coastal Conservancy was looking for somebody to pick this easement up and manage it and be responsible for it. So we stepped up and, and said we will. And so actually the easement, not only to this beach, but to the sidewalk all around this marina is actually uh, is, is recorded in Orange County Coastkeeper's name. Um, and, and so we have the easement, we do not own the property. So well, the only way this is going to, to work, and if you get a chance on the board over there, we have a conceptual design on, on how we would like to work with the property owner in, in improving this property. But basically the ultimate goal is, is this, so this is for the benefit of the public. And we want, we think, you know, if, if in time, if, make some improvements. This would be a great place to go get a sandwich on PCH or somewhere and come here and have lunch. It'd be a great place to launch kayaks or, or to fish. Um, possibly, we haven't tried that yet. But, you know, we want to, today's, the purpose of today is just to announce that, that this is a public resource, a public asset. And, and um, just this last week, if you notice in the parking lot, uh, you you notice there's there's tens parking parking places places that are all designated as beach parking, and that's new. And so, what we want to do is just bring attention, and and we also, by the way, Portofino at the end of Edinger, we also um, have the easement there with the sidewalk around the seawall around the unit. And there we have electronic gates that open and shut at midnight, and we purchase the park benches and the trash cans and. And we, we make sure that whole area is maintained uh, for the public benefit. And so it's important, and, and you'd be surprised in Orange County and, and along our coast how many areas are, are, for pub, are set aside for public access, many of which are being picked up, but there's many that are not. And so it's something that uh, Coast Keepers, many projects, this is one thing that we so that That ends my elongated comments. Um, and Pam wants me to cast this, but she doesn't realize there's not a weight on here. <laughs>